Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So late on Friday last week in my part of the world, on the 26th of July, Microsoft rolled out the latest Insider Preview build to the Dev Channel Insiders, build 26120.1330, which was made available with the update KB5040543. So if you are interested as to what Microsoft is working on in the Insider program, just a quick video to focus on what's happening last week in the Dev Channel. Now we do get a couple of uh, new improvements and features. And the first one has already rolled out to the stable version, which was made available uh, in last week's optional bug fix C release update, which I did post on and I'll leave that link down below and in the end screen. And that's the ability to duplicate a tab by right clicking on a tab in the file explorer. So that's available in stable and also now in the dev channel. And if you are using tabs in the file explorer, that may be a nice move in the right direction. And I'm just going to mention the next one. Uh, there um, is a couple of improvements rolling out for Narrator. And I'm always in favor of accessibility improvements in any operating system and um, browser, as I've mentioned previously, where Microsoft say they've made several changes to improve the performance of Narrator scan mode. Apparently, this is expected to make scan mode responses much quicker, especially while using Microsoft Edge and reading through large documents. So that's some improvements to Narrator. And the next update to settings was actually a hidden feature when I posted on it, on it um, at first in a previous video. And just another indication that hidden features can make their way into official testing. And this, as you can see, they are beginning to roll out improvements to settings, system power and battery, including the ability to set power mode for both when your PC is plugged in and when it's on battery with Microsoft saying along with a few other UI improvements to the actual power and battery page. And I think this is a nice move uh, in the right direction, uh, just giving us those options for plugged in and on battery for your power and battery modes. And to some extent or the other, this is available in the legacy control panel, but um, nice to see it now moving into the settings. So another hidden feature is now available for official testing in last week's dev channel inside a build. And the next one has also made its way to stable and kind of across the board. And they've updated the logic for the end task option in the taskbar so that it no longer shows a not responding dialog uh, to give confirmation before um, ending the task. So that's also rolled out to the stable. And then we get a fix for settings. And then obviously there are a couple of known issues because it's, because it is still early days. So known issues are expected in the dev channel. And just a reminder about the dev channel, um, just on a quick side note, Microsoft says that updates released to the dev channel are based on and off Windows 11 version 24H2, which is this year's annual feature update. Features and experiences Experiences included in these builds may never get released as they try out different concepts and get feedback. And many features in the dev channel are rolled out using a controlled feature rollout, starting with a small subset of insiders. So just take note of that regarding the dev channel. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.